from 50 Shades of Mom. Welcome back to my channel and another grocery haul video. So this is my very last grocery haul before vacation. So I did all of my final setting up for Daryl and anything that he may need, all the final things that I need for tomorrow's event. Today is Friday and tomorrow I have my catering event and I had some amazing couponing deals that I wanted to take care of before I left. So wait till you guys see what and what all this ended up costing by the time that I was done. So we'll start down here. I got, oh, Walmart, Aldi, and Walgreens back there in the corner. So this is Walmart first. I got the big bag of the pedigree dog food for the dogs. Daryl, just in case you guys don't follow me on any of my other social media, if you don't, you should. I have 50 Shades of Mom on Facebook, on Instagram, on Pinterest, and then on Snapchat. I am Kira-Dira. I'll put all the links on the screen, plus they're in the description box below. But if you didn't know or didn't catch my YouTube video a couple of months ago on a grocery haul, my husband had lost his job, and so it's been a couple of rough months getting back on her feet but he finally did get a job so I'm super excited about that hooray and he is going to be the GM of our local five guys so he needed to wear jeans and he needed just some new ones so I actually found these here at Walmart that were reduced down to seven dollars can you guys see that so I was super excited about that because I don't like to buy quality jeans for him to go to work with because he's just going to beat them up. And obviously, if I can catch decent jeans for a good deal, these were originally 15, so everything here was 50% off, which is why they were marked down to seven. So I got him two pairs of jeans for work. Jake said he needed underwear, and there was a $2 I bought a rebate, so I got him this. I'll get him another pair for school, but I'm just going to bring this with me so he has some fresh underwear for when I get there. These were like those cheeky kind of underwears that I got for myself, a melon and a gray, and the front part of it is like lacy, but then the back is like the silky kind. So I thought these were really cute and these were on clearance for $2, I believe. So like I said, I got the gray and the melon. These I've been using the, I love, been we've been obsessed with all the wet wipes, but I love Scott products. And I've been using the Scott one. I've never tried the Cottonelle before, but these are $1.97 and there's a 50 cent off rebate on Ibotta and then I had a dollar off coupon. So for 47 cents, I just figured I would leave some extra wipes here for Daryl so that he has them. We got a loaf of our everything bread so I can come home to that. I had a bunch of rebates on these things. I don't even think these things ended up costing me a quarter by the time I was done with them because I had a dollar fifty off of three, another dollar fifty on another um, app. So that was like $3 off, and then I had a $0.50 cents off one, and another $0.75 cents off another. So it was like four twenty-five, and these things are one and a quarter. So I paid, you know, well, I don't even know. However, that breaks down to $0.70, cents or I don't even know. Um, but I did a really, really good job with those. So I was really happy with that. I figured Daryl could just eat these and take them on the go. And I got him the pepperoni pizza, the pepperoni cheese bites, the turkey and cheese and the bacon club. So they're on like a flat wrap and they look good. So I think he'll like just having that as something to take. Leanne Snapchatted about these donut peaches and I've never seen a donut peach before in my life, but they are so stinking cute and they smell so sweet. So I'm gonna bring these in the car with us as long as, as well as these little tiny, it's a small it's like bunch of bananas I can find, just a four pack. So I'll bring that with us in the car. I got a thing of sour cream for Daryl for him to make dip with chips. Okay, this was a banging Ibotta deal, guys. Check out your Ibotta right now. So if you buy any family size box of Cheerios, any, any flavor or variety, as long as it's a family size, you get any one of their new flavors of cereal for free. So they'll give you a $3.75 off credit. This was $3.62, so you're already making an extra $0.13 cents right there. But then I had a dollar off of this, a dollar off of any two General Mills. Then I had $0.50 cents off of any 
Cheerios. And then Saving Star has a dollar off of any two. So it ends up coming to a dollar 41 for both boxes. So you can't really beat 70 cents a box. We're going to use this in the taste test video. I think Jake will love that. And then this I'm just gonna throw in my donation bag. So I thought that was an amazing deal. I got the cold cuts that we need for sandwiches on Sunday, the day that I leave. So I got our normal Castlewood, the ham, and the turkey. So whatever sandwiches we don't eat for dinner that night or take on the road, I can leave Daryl with. And then these street kitchens, I mentioned these once before when I said the lemonade mom uses, like, you know, likes to eat all the Indian kind of food, and I had seen a bunch of the Indian ones, and I had bought something else that I tried, and it was really, really good, and it was simple, and it was easy, and these are all non-GMO, and no artificial anything, and this one was on clearance, and it's the barbacoa barbecue beef, which my girlfriend Jill said she loves when she goes to Chipotle, so I got that for $1.50, you kind of can't beat that. Okay, so I got another box of these. I had the peanut butter chocolate ones and they were absolutely dynamite. And there is a 50 cents on Staving Star. I had a 50 cent off coupon and there's a 50 cent on Ibotta. So you couldn't beat $1.50 off and these are three bucks. So I ended up getting this for $1.50 and this time I tried something different. Oops, this is the Peak Edition and it's the almond butter double chocolate. So I'm excited about that to try that. This is the good table stuff that we love and use, and it was also on clearance at $1.86. This is a Thai peanut, so I got that. This one's also the no artificial anything um, that we use. Like, I usually use this on pork chops, and it's so darn good. Two coffee creamers for Daryl. Another good deal on our pizzas. So they were, you know, the dollar a piece, plus I had a dollar off of four, and Saving Star still has a dollar off of four. So I ended up paying 50 cents a piece. I've done free, but this is the best I've been able to get lately because not every app has the rebate anymore. This was another really good deal. I picked out up some of the double chocolate mini donuts at a bunch of Hostess coupons. So these were $2 each a piece. I had $1.50 off in coupons. So I paid 75 cents a bag. So I thought that was good. Got the original potato chips. These are only a dollar. So I got that for Dell for dip and snacks dog food for the dogs this way between that and that big bag he should not need dog food while I'm gone I got two half gallons of milk just one that I can take on the road with me in my cooler so the kids have milk on the road but then one I could leave here for Daryl and it won't be open so it'll last longer and he could use it when he you know needs to open it these Ben and Jerry slices were a really good deal. There's an Ibotta rebate for $1.25 or a dollar, and then I had a dollar twenty-five off coupon. Either way, I got two twenty-five off of these, and they're four fifty. So I thought half off was really good. Daryl's had these a bunch of times, and he really liked them. So I just got a couple of ice creams for him to have, and then I got another one of these meat lover things. He liked the other one, so he'll have one of those while we were gone. And I got a four pack of the bacon cheddar burgers. They were $4.83 marked down. So I got that to throw in the freezer for burgers when we get home. So that is it for Walmart. Aldi's was really simple and really easy just because again, I needed some filler things and I'm leaving. So I got two bags of chocolate chips for my chocolate chip cookies that I'm baking for this event these white organic cheddar puffs that we are absolutely obsessed with. We love them. I got these Simple Nature Fruit Leathers. This was expensive, like $4.99. It's like expensive for all these, but there is 21 in here, which my girlfriend said is a good deal for the, you know, non-GMO or organic fruit leathers. So I got the raspberry ones to bring with us. Two hot dog rolls for Daryl to have while we're gone. A thing of extra hamburger buns to bring to my event tomorrow. Another loaf of bread for him for the freezer. Those are the Jiffy corn muffin um, boxes that I need for the event tomorrow. My Red Bull for the road. Definitely need that. Some dark sweet cherries. I've been obsessed with cherries lately. I don't even know what my issue is, but I keep going through package after package. So I got a thing of that and just a cheap thing of eggs. These were only 75 cents, but I need a lot of eggs 
for my cornbread. So I figured I would just get them there. And there's a 25 cent off checkout 51 for eggs. So these will only end up being 54 cents. So the whole Aldi's was $20 and 49 cents. And then I'll do the breakdown for Walmart in a minute because that's like the final breakdown. But I want to show you guys this. I've never shown you guys a Walgreens haul before, but I did so good that I had to share. So with all of my coupons, I even put my receipt here so I can show you guys I am not fooling. So all of these things right here cost 75 cents. So I got the Garnier Fructis, the Sleek and Shine, Paraben Free, the Fortifying Conditioner and Shampoo. So I can bring those with me to my mom's. And then I got a container of the OxyClean HD White Revive. It's like more like a color safe bleach. So I'll use this instead of my Clorox too. I got a box of the Crest 3D White. This is the 3.5 ounce tube. I got a thing of the Mitchum deodorant. This is the 48 hour sport protection. Now that's what I went for, okay? But I had right here five items and six coupons. I should have known this from Nicole, but I didn't. And you can only use one coupon per item. So being that I had six, I'd, six coupons and five items, I had to buy something else. So it would have been even less, but I bought a 59 cent lollipop just so I can throw something else and be able to use all of my coupons. So here you can see everything that I bought all the way down and then Here's where, see all my coupons worked. My subtotal was 56 cents because the lollipop was 59 cents. So the sales tax was $1.19, came to 175. I redeemed $1 in rewards, leaving me only owing 75 cents. I paid a dollar and got a quarter back. So all those things right there were 75 cents. And I thought that was a bang out smoking hot deal for all that stuff. So I'm so excited about that. And thank you to Nicole and for putting her channel up because she has just shown me how to kick ass at Walgreens and CVS and I miss couponing like that like crazy. So again, check her out. I will put her channel below. I will put the Lemonade Mom's channel as well in the description box since I mentioned her as well. You guys should go and check out both of those channels. So here is my, let me move my coffee. This is, I wrote down some notes here just so I had everything um, down. So, okay, so the total for Walmart was $119.14. I had $22.05 in rebates and manufacturer's coupons. I redeemed $20 in Ibotta money, leaving me with $77.09 at the register for all this stuff at Walmart. And then my total was $20.49 at Aldi's with a $0.25 cent rebate, making um, Aldi's $20.24. And then, like I said, I only spent 75 cents at Walgreens making all of these things $98, guys, and eight cents. So there's no way that you can beat under $100 for all of this stuff. So, and the benefit for me was I also had a $20 gift card, so it even cost me even less. So I cannot beat that. That's super exciting to me. So hit that thumbs up button guys if you like couponing and you loved all the deals that I got at Walgreens because that really was kick ass this week. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye everyone.